Drew Clay. The college basketball season has been anything but friendly to the Cajuns this season who can barely field a team. Louisiana has dealt with a plethora of injuries and hasn't put more than nine players or suited up more than nine players in a given game since returning from the holiday break. The team dressed out eight tonight hosting UTA. Dugay out sick. Cajuns down 10-4 less than three minutes in. PJ Hardy to Jalen Johnson. He gets the three Hardy back from injury. Still in the first quarter, Tyrus Smith, our first half, I should say, takes the pass from the top to the key and turns it into an and one. Louisiana down by five. UTA would widen their lead, though, when David Azor gets the ball inside and Jabrari Narcy slams it in. Cajuns trail by as many as 13, but right there before the buzzer, it's Calvin Temple. 50-41 Mavericks at the break on top by nine. Second half of the game, mostly UTA. DeAndre Young gets the three-pointer. That's seven threes on the night for them. Cajuns don't go down without a fight. Cedric Russell hits Johnson for the easy bucket. Johnson with a team-high 23. However, it was not enough as UTA gives Louisiana their third straight loss, 81-65. Coach Bob Marlin says injuries are no excuse for how this team has played. I feel sorry for the Cajuns, whether we have a full deck or half a deck, it doesn't matter. So we're going to have to continue to fight, and, and uh, I thought we did that for a while tonight. Have to have better guard play. I was disappointed in uh, Cedric, PJ, and Calvin Temple. They have to play better, and they, they have played better, and I expect better. Earlier today, the Cajun women also fell to UTA 79-52. Louisiana effectively trailed wire to wire. UTA guard Marie Benson scored a career.